oh, she's not doing that with you. And then you and I also said, that. and I also said what, and I and I also said what they said the sister was coming for you too. I said I don't know. I'm not addressing yeah, the she's sister. Yeah, because she's not a celebrity. And what did Malago say? Fuck that bitch and bop, bop, bop. That's not, that's, that's not, I'm not getting into that fight. Right. That's not my fight. That's not my fight. I'm not taking on no bitches beat. But you did say, you was like, I'm not addressing Hennessy. Hennessy is not the celebrity. She can, she'll get, it'll just be paid. You will pay it. Right. Right. And so you think I'm about to be, I'm not, and you can say I'm for myself, whatever, but are you, you going to see Milagro Grams jump into my motherfucking beast? No. She's going to post it as such and let you guys drag and do what you guys are going to do in the comments. It's cool. So, but she, it, people don't, we're not jumping in each other's beef because you know why? What is her jumping in all of my beef? Is that going to do, did she jump in my lotto beef as my, as the female commentator, as a woman? Did she jump young in Miami. the beef when, with, with Jay, young Miami, JT? Did she come in and be like, don't be talking to my brother like that, bitch? Da, 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 da. She don't say shit. I don't ask You're her right. to. I don't expect her to. But, and I don't get mad that she still live for JT or live for these girls that don't like me or whatever. But like, it, it, like, how could I? Did, did, did I expect her to fucking stop fucking with Nicki Minaj because Nicki didn't like me? No. And I mean, even when you guys had to sit down, it was addressed about Cardi. And you did try to, you know, make the amendments then, you know, and you, you and, tried and, to. And, 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 and in all fairness, in all fairness, let's just talk about it. Me and, me and Malagua, me and Cardi have similar, you know, getting like background. Me and Cardi started off drug. We didn't see eye to eye. Me and Milagro did not start off cool. So it's the same thing. So Cardi, Cardi B, as much as that Milagro talks shit about Cardi B and her friends and family and this, that, and the third, I, I took, you don't think that Cardi B may be part of the relationship that I don't have with Cardi B is because, bitch, she looking at me like, bitch, you hella cool with this bitch and I don't like her. That's true, too. So that's probably why I never got as close as I could because in the back of Cardi B mind, she probably like, bitch, you fuck with that Milagro Grams bitch. I don't fuck with her. And you running around like that. And it's just, you know, it's just literally just a safety precaution. Y'all dressing together. Y'all keep keying together. But nobody sees that side. All of a sudden, Milagro's the victim. How do you know that my relationship with Cardi B hadn't been fucked up just for me taking pictures It's a conflict of interest. So why is it Because how could you be cool with a bitch that ain't cool with me? You know how, that's really what it is. But, but, but for somehow, you know, but it's okay when I'm cool with Milagro and Cardi B not fuck with me, but it's not okay for me to be cool with Cardi B and be cool for, with Milagro on Milagro's end. Fuck out of here with that bullshit. Fuck out of here. Because you, just the same way you feel, Cardi B could feel the same way about me. For fucking with That's you. That's true. And like I said, everything that you've stated up to this point, I, I agree with you. I'm not discounting nothing you're saying in regards to the way that you've explained your version. I but my thing is, sides. you see how I get caught in the middle and I don't get exactly. any grace. Everybody else is the fucking victim. And I'm just being cool on both sides, but it, I just, that's why I'm but like, I'm gonna be honest, all these I'm motherfuckers. Like, you know what it is. It's like, when you have a gay black man as an ally, and I hate to say it like this, but I'm gonna say it. Y'all are used as fucking tokens. Y'all are used as trophies. Mm -hmm. Y'all are used as a weapon of fucking mass destruction. And I'm really not understanding what the caveat is aside from you and this is not Milagro specifically, but I'm really not understanding what the caveat is in order e to even make them attachments to you, aside from you being able to have a voice that represents them in a positive light, which does them no good because I have heard you criticize everybody that you get praise to. So what's the point? Well, because we can cultivate an audience and bitch and I and I'm and, I, and I'm a motherfucker. I'll go rogue on their ass and, and people will still follow. As much as bitches think I give them clout or as much as these celebrities think that I need them, I still am able to obtain an audience because bitch, I'm good at what the fuck I do. And so they're like, well, shit, we still need to keep this nigga around because this nigga can fuck around and get on TV. Or something, you know, even if it's not yep. TV, it's like, well, he gets opportunities. And even if they don't want to know the people, you are a person, you know, so you do have a very yeah. positive. I'm not going to say, you know, all the time positive, but in a lot of regards, you do have a positive voice. You do represent a heavy sector of female culture when it comes to hip hop. And also it's your stance. Like you are doing something a lot of them are not doing specifically for female artists, but you know, like I get it. But at the same time, it's like, 
what does that say as far as them towards you? Like, is it always you have to benefit them? Why is it that someone can't gravitate to you and give you a gene with friendship? And again, this is not for Milagro. I love Millie, so please don't carry this back. Like, oh, this bitch up in here talking about Millie. Because I know how people are. 